like his uncle and my mother were married, but they're not related. Did that work? I'd have to pull the definition. I think it, I think it would. I'd have to pull the definition out and just double check. All right. Um, Wow. So this, this, this is a question. So the questions are, what restrictions or license requirements are there, if any, for a private money lender to loan money to a real estate investment, a real estate investor or a company if the sole purpose for the loan is to buy non-owner occupied residential investment properties? I'm not aware of any. I mean, if you're just talking about someone, if you're just talking about someone, me, who's got some money and I want to loan to someone else for them to go out and buy some non-owned or occupied residential investment properties. I'm not aware of any special, special restrictions or licensing requirements that would require to that, that kind of loan as opposed to, I mean, there are, there are general usury restrictions on the interest rate that you can charge that would apply to, that apply to loans. But in terms of some other special permit or license you got to have, I'm not aware of any. Yeah, I think what they're getting to, Richard, is new Dodd-Frank requirements. They don't apply to non-owner occupied property. If it's a business loan from an investor to uh, a business user, there should not be any licensing requirements. Currently, they'll, they'll get that next year. Yeah, and there, there, there's a there's a follow-up question on that. And again, I'll, I'm primarily a commercial real estate guy, not a residential real estate guy. So there's a follow-up question on that that relates to LLCs that I my my answer would be worthless on. I'm not a Dodd Frank guy. Which type of entity is best to simply manage real estate, not own it? S corporation or LLC? I'd probably still, I'd probably still use an LLC. Um, and, and the reason why, again, the reason why is, um, you know, there's, n there's fewer things to screw up with the multiple classes of ownership and stock and all that. I, I just would, I just would probably use an LLC. And you'd have a zero valuation of the property. Yeah, that's right. 